do torque plates really matter? On today's episode, we're gonna find out. So I just finished honing this block from 65 to 70 over for a set of diamond forged pistons. And it's, it's cooled off, everybody's happy, and the cylinder's round and straight within a tenth or two. So we're gonna measure it just like it is, and we're gonna show you the dial bar gauge, and then I'm gonna take the plate off, and then we're gonna measure it again and see is the torque plate actually distorting the bore and how much is distorting the bore? So, I mean, that's pretty much dead zero. And then 90 degrees is dead zero. And right in line with the studs, we still zero. And I assume if we're going to see some deviation, we're going to see it in line with the studs. So let's get the, top, the plate off. So we'll hit it straight on. So it actually closed up about four tenths front to back. And if we go 90 degrees, it's still zero. And then in line with the studs, it closed up about a tenth. Yeah, and it's about a tenth on that side too. Let's check it down low. Say 90 degrees. So down at the bottom, it didn't affect it, just at the top. Yeah, that's surprising in that direction, I really didn't think I'd see anything, but I mean, that's that's four tenths that it closed the bore up. So will it, will it work without torque plate honing? Definitely, but if you want a round straight bore, this is the way to do it. So there you have it. Thanks for watching, like, share, subscribe. Have a great day.